Hey everyone, I'm Groundhole, and welcome back to Let's Play Tales from Space About a Blob. This is, with all likelihood, going to be the final episode of this game, so uh, let's just dive right in. Not gonna savor it or nothing. It's gonna go. Ah! Uh, ah! Wrong button. Dang. Why am I hitting the wrong button? Oh, right! I can just land on tanks. Sometimes, I guess. Ah ha ha! Oh, blimp. Can I destroy blimp? I can destroy blimp! Can't absorb blimp, though. And the lack of changing colors when I attempted it implies that I can never destroy Blimp. Why Blimp no want to be destroyed? Er, eaten. Why did I say destroyed? I meant eaten. Wow, that, that was me missing a lot. Blimp! Come on, Blimp, let me see what your owl made of. Apart from helium and, um, owl. And missiles, apparently. Whew! Full heal, thanks to random blobby friend down here. Okay, that's better. Ah, ah, got you from off screen. And that gets cracked. Oh dear. Ow, 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 ow. That, w that was just bad. I, I really have no excuse for that. Why'd that go down? Oh, because there was a thing of mine underneath it. Next question. Kind of an obvious one. How fast do I... Uh, how fast do I need to be going to jump up above that? Dang. Oh. Again, there was something of mine underneath. Hey, you. I'm talking to you. I'm not big enough? What do you mean I'm not big enough? I'm totally big enough. Oh, dear. I, I, I appear to be at some sort of uh, a, a problem area. So I had to die in order to continue to grow. Ow. Blasted missiles. Alright, um... I, I need to find something else to feast upon. Because... Apparently what I've found so far is not sufficient. <laughs> that was probably enough. That right there. Ow. Okay, so I shouldn't have been worried about charging right through the military as I was. Alright, so anyway, uh, la di da. Ha ha! Ha ha! Ha ha! Oh man. Okay. And this time there was nothing of mine underneath. Oh, always handy. That time there is. Give me that car. Hey! 
<laughs> Alright, and down here. And further down here. New goal! Really freaking big. Alright. I, I suppose I can do that. Oh dear. They're nuking me now? Do, do I have to run away? I do have to run away from a giant wall of fire. Oh dear. What? I had to drain the electricity from a thing in order to make some buildings rise up? Whoa. Giant wall of atomic fire. Probably not the best idea to dilly dally. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, bunch of stuff. Oh! Uh, want something a little bit bigger? And I got a little bit bigger a lot faster than I was expecting. Squeeze through, thank you. Ha ha ha! So is that, uh, wall of flame still following me? Because that, that would be somewhat annoying. Well, I suppose I could go and look up how far atomic blasts actually affect. But that sounds like work. And I am... I'm absorbing buildings now. This is kind of ridiculous and awesome. Huh? Huh? Ha ah, ha ha! Skyscrapers! Feel my... inner stomach lining. Oh. Not all the skyscrapers. Eiffel Tower! Yeah, what? Ha 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 Can't. Oh, I still can't get... Okay, now I can. Uh, da 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 da... This really is reminding me of the last level of Katamari Damacy. Last level of the Maw? Eh, not so much. <laughs> For too much longer, I'll be able to absorb an island. Awesome. How long until I can absorb a bubble city? Okay, so... Put myself up there. Put myself up here. And jump! And totally not make it. Oh well. It was worth a shot. Now can I absorb the islands? I can! Ha 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 ha! Alright. Anyway. <laughs> Statue of Liberty! No! famous world monument is safe from me. Not even the CNET Tower. Oh dear. But, but how do I get up to it? Like that. Okay. Is this another nuke? No, it's some sort of orbital death laser satellite. Ah! Oh, oh dear. Wee! Wee! Ow. Give me those back. I need those. Oh, oh, man. I ate that too soon. Just after eating it, or just as I was eating it, I noticed a blobby friend up there. Oh, well. I suppose I can't win them all. 
Also, I am 36 kilometers wide. How far down in the Earth am I that I'm in caverns that are, what, five times as tall as I am? That's, uh... <laughs> That's 180 kilometers tall. That's a lot! I mean... I just missed a Cthulhu statue? Oh, going back, going back. Can I, can I get back up? Can I get back up? I can! I need the Cthulhu statue! I'll shove it down so I can eat it once I'm bigger. Come on, I, I, I need to get bigger so I can eat the Cthulhu statue. Come on, where is it? How far down did I shove it? Oh, there it is. Still not big enough. Must get bigger. Must get bigger. Come on. Ah ha ha ha! Ah, I have eaten Cthulhu. Well, you know the old saying, if you meet the Buddha, kill the Buddha. Well, if you meet the Cthulhu, eat the Cthulhu. That, that's that, that's an old Lovecraftian saying, right? I, I seem to recall hearing that somewhere. And I think I'm going to collect a bunch of these in order to try for at least a silver medal on the final level. Even though I've been completely ignoring them up to now. Well, mostly ignoring them. How deep am I now? I'm at the core. This is the core of the planet. No, it's not. Gravity is still pulling me downwards. I'm going to eat the core of the planet. I'm going to get a bronze medal because I did not start going for the gems soon enough. Ha ha ha, molten core. But the, the gravity there didn't make any sense at all. Like, none. Oh dear. I have no ammunition. Oh dear. Ah! Okay. Um. So... I absorbed half of his stuff. Ow. You must have noticed that the, uh... The low to the ground ones are harder for me to get. Oh dear! This is going to be a long fight. Unless I'm horribly mistaken. Or unless I manage to start stealing his electricity faster. Like, you know, faster than that. Oh boy. Jump, jump, oh dang. Jump, jump! <sighs> Come on. Gimme, thank you. What are you doing now? Oh dear. Ah, uh, ow! Why did I jump into your spikes? Why did I do that? Ah, uh, dang it! How many of those things do you have to shoot out? There, okay. Um... Oh dear.
Okay, so... If I sit underneath him, will I be safe? No. No, I will not. I will super not be safe. He's not even half dead. Oh, I am so dying here. I am so incredibly dying here. Oh, come on! Oh! This isn't even close to fair. I've got one hit point left, dude. Now you're using new tactics? Okay, uh, I was able to hit his brain. Um... No death, please? That one landed right on me. And boss fight starts over again. Okay, we're about back to where he killed me last time. And now I get to try to find somewhere with limited fire. This works well enough. Ah! Why does he do that attack? I mean, it hurts. It, it is a hurtful attack. Okay. Yay, I live. I really do not like this attack, especially when he doubles up the ground ones. Which side is he empty on? He's empty on that side. Okay. Thanks for coming toward me. That, that was a real cool thing of you. Real cool thing of you? A real cool thing of you to do, that is. I should probably not run into the spikes. Am I done? Did I... did I destroy the villain? Is the scientist in there? Scientist is in there, isn't he? Yay! And... Is he about to be eaten by a blob? <laughs> well, his capsule broke. And he had an escape pod. An escape pod careening off into the distance. But the rest of his thing got eaten by the blob along with the planet. <laughs> yeah. Oh look, we left the planet all shiny and new. And yeah, you know, the same way we did with that other planet. See, we blobs are a friendly sort. Just, just ignore any maniacal laughter. That, that, that's, that's a weird blob-related quirk. Yeah. So anyway, this has been Tales from Space about a blob. I'm Granhall. Tune in next time for. I don't know, something else. Not this. We finished this. We, we don't need to play this anymore. Oh! Cutscene. Oh. Credits. Oh, I suppose I'll let you guys see the credits. So, uh... Yeah. Th this game was fun. Like... <laughs> ah, that thing. Um... If this game has, uh, uh, bleh, has, if this game ever gets some sort of sequel, I will definitely check it out. Because, like I said, this game was fun. It, it had a few rather annoying moments, but then what game doesn't? Oh, hey, I never noticed this was the Red Army. Heh <laughs> CNET Tower. I ate that. 
But, uh, yeah. And a very special thanks to you viewers at home. Without whom, this wouldn't have been seen. Yep. Oh, that's why the CNET Tower is in there, because it was made in Ontario. Oh, I'm, I'm glad I stuck through the credits. This appears to be more cutscene. And the scientist is determined to catch those blobs. Alright, well, like I said before, this has been Tales from Space about a blob. I'm Granhol. See you next time.